My name is uh, J. Michael Bennett. I'm an orthopedic sports medicine physician who specializes in minimally invasive surgical options for surgery of the shoulder, elbow, and knee. And welcome to another uh, video edition of the Whiteboard Series. Today we're actually just going to go in a, a behind the scenes look at what happens at the time of surgery. And welcome to the operating room. This is where all the magic happens regarding orthopedic surgery. Uh, this is basically the OR bed where um, patient is positioned, depending on the type of procedure that we're doing, depend, or determines the position that we put the patient in. If we're working on the shoulder, we usually put the patient in what is called a beach chair position, where we actually lift the back of the bed up and you're literally sitting like you're on a beach chair. And we work on the shoulder. Now some doctors like to work in a lateral decubitus position, where we actually have the patient laying on their side, occasionally with the arm in traction to get to the shoulder, kind of holding the arm up while they work in the shoulder. So those are two ways to work on the shoulder arthroscopically. Um, now if you're doing an open procedure on the shoulder, usually most surgeons will operate uh, on the patient in a beach chair position where they're sitting upright. Other, other extremities that we work on, obviously if you're working on the wrist or the elbow, you're going to be in a supine position, which is we have the patient laying down on their back and usually put a board connected here where the arm is outstretched and we work on the wrist or hand of the elbow. Now when I do an arthroscopic procedure or a scope on the elbow, I occasionally will have a patient laying on their side, what's called lateral decubitus position, on what's called an elbow holder, which is attached to the side of the bed here and allows me to get to the back of the elbow with the scope. Uh, if you're doing any kind of knee surgery, uh, usually you're going to be lying just on your back here and uh, the knee will be dropped off the side of the table while the surgeon works on the knee. Now some surgeons will also work on the knee standing up and if that's the case we have you laying down and we drop this down and they basically have them standing up holding the leg while they're operating on the leg. Uh, that's mostly for arthroscopic procedures and if we're doing an open procedure oftentimes we just operate with the patient laying down on their back with the knee here uh, while we're operating. This makes it very easy. You can see underneath this table here, there's nothing there. Um, there's, the support is a little bit higher up and that allows us to bring in x-ray, which is called C-arm, to allow us to look at the ankle, at the knee, at the, at the femur, um, to look at it using a C-arm fluoroscopy, which is a type of x-ray. This right here is an arthroscopic screen. When we're actually doing scopes in the knee, shoulder, or elbow, this shows us what's going on within the joint itself and allows us to do our procedure. Um, the rest of the uh, instrumentation, as you can see, is on the back walls here. And these are the big, uh, the big OR lights that allow us to see what's going on in the operating room as well. So in a nutshell, that's basically it regarding the operating room from pre-op to operating room. At this point, the patient is usually put uh, waken up after the surgery, uh, woken up after the surgery and brought to the post-operative recovery, which is very similar to the pre-operative uh, section that we talked about at the beginning of this video. So if you have any questions regarding your surgery, please discuss it thoroughly with your physician before the procedure. You do not want to wait till the day of surgery to ask any kind of important questions like, you know, what's the risk associated with surgery? What are my options? Um, is this really necessary? This all, all needs to be discussed and thoroughly thought about before the day of surgery. We want you to be relaxed, we want you to be confident about your procedure, and confident about your surgeon, the day of surgery, and, and, and we want to get you fixed up and, uh, and, and in the most expeditious and efficient way possible. If you have any other questions, please go to my website. It's uh, jmichaelbennett.com or orthopedicsportsdoctor.com or please feel free to call my office at 281-633-8600 for a consultation. Thank you very much.